Hi guys, Miss Pascal here. It is so good to see you guys. I hope that you had the best spring break off. I hope that you took some time away from school and you played outside or you read a book or you hung out with your brothers and your sisters or your mom or your dad. Um, I hope that you had the best week off and I hope that you had some fun too. I am back to do our read alouds and this week, actually this week and next week, I'm gonna be reading some books about life cycles. So the next unit of science for us is all about life cycles. So we're gonna be learning about the life cycle of butterflies, we're gonna be learning about the life cycle of frogs, and we're gonna be learning about the life cycle of plants. So today, your reading activity is all about the life cycle of a butterfly. So I figured I would read a one of my favorite books about the life cycle of a butterfly. You may have read this book before too. It is called The Very Impatient Caterpillar by Ross Baratch. Hey, what are you guys doing? We are going to metamorphosize. Meadow what now? Transform into butterflies. Right, right. I knew that. Wait, you're telling me I can become a butterfly? Yes. With wings? Yes. For real? Yes. Wait for me. Now what? Build your chrysalis. Chrysalis, right, right. I knew that. What? How did you do that? Is it a spin or more of a twirl? Am I a butterfly yet? Ugh. Now what? Just be patient and let nature take its course. Patience, right, right, I got this. Am I a butterfly yet? No. Am I, how about now? No. Now? No. Be patient. I have a question. Not yet. You don't even know what I was going to ask. Fine, ask. How's your day going? Also, am I a butterfly yet? No, just be patient. Shh, we're trying to metamorphosize. Okay, okay. Obviously, I know this. But do you know how long this takes? Two weeks. Right, right. Two weeks. Two weeks? for 
a new approach. Okay, you can do this. You can be patient. Oh, who am I kidding? I can't be patient. You are the little caterpillar that could. I am the little caterpillar that couldn't. Get a grip. You can. I can't. I can't. You can. I can't. You can. I can't. You can. I can't. Can. Can't. I can be patient. Patience is all in the mind. Be one with the chrysalis. Deep breath in and out. Look, day six. I'm doing it. Just be patient. Just be patient. Two weeks later. I did it! I'm a butterfly. You know, I do feel transformed. Starting now, I'm going to be way more patient. That's great. Hey, where are you all going? We're migrating. Migrating? Right, right. Wait for me. Are we there yet? The end. Um, the Very Impatient Caterpillar is one of my favorite books to read when we start learning about life cycles. So I hope you guys enjoyed that funny book with me. Um, we are <clears throat> starting to learn about the life cycle of a butterfly today. And we're going to keep learning about some more of the life cycles throughout the week um, during our read aloud. So we'll have some that are about the butterfly life cycle like this one um, and others about frog and insects and some other um, animals out there for their life cycles. My Monday challenge for you guys is going to be to play a board game. Uh, Mr. Hennessy and I had a lot of fun playing some board games together over the break. And so my challenge for you guys today, should you choose to accept it, is to play a board game with somebody in your family. You can play um, whatever board game you have at home. And if you don't play it, if you don't have a board game, you can play a card game or you could even play a game like tag. Um, but my challenge for you guys today is just to play a game with your family um, sometime today or this week. I have loved seeing you guys today. I am happy that we are all back and ready to keep learning through second grade the rest of our year. Um, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.